like the video and subscribe if you love Roblox. Hey yo, what is going on guys? My name is Illusions Ghost. Welcome back to another video guys. And inside of this video, we are back inside of Build A Boats Forge or Reja Roblox. Oh, once again, guys. So anyway, if you guys haven't already, make sure you guys all hit like button, subscribe, and of course turn on the notifications. Like, guys, do not miss a single look below the channel. The single update is out of below for treasure. And inside of this video, we are actually going to be going over how to get a conveyor inside of below for treasure. So make sure you guys all stay tuned throughout this video because it, you know, has it requires a whole tutorial. So anyway, make sure you guys all stay tuned and continue watching. All right. We now got somebody new up on the family. Their name is Birthday Boy Blam. Congratulations, Birthday Boy Blam, for actually getting their name up on the fan wall guys if you guys actually do want your name to get up on the fan wall all you guys need to do hit that like button subscribe and leave a comment down below and without further ado let's jump straight into this video guys so if you guys you know are watching this video and you guys are like why would i ever use a conveyor all right a lot of the conveyors are actually used for stuff like afk farms and stuff like that you typically just afk farms okay but you know i guess there are other reasons why you would also use you know if conveyor belts guys but anyway let's jump straight into this tutorial so what we need to do is we actually need to head down over to the um water all right so once we are actually at the water this is actually one method of doing this guys all right so basically what this actually does is harness the power of the water and actually makes a conveyor for everybody to actually walk on all right so first step guys all right is you want to take any block doesn't matter and about you know a couple couple blocks distance away from the water you actually want to go and build up a little bit like three blocks high and then what you guys want to do is you want to take out your favorite harpoon all right um I did, i've never tried it with the with this harpoon so i i just wouldn't use this one i've never tried it i suggest using the golden harpoon there's actually a way how to get these for free um but if you know you do not have this okay they do also cost robux all right but anyway you simply need to shoot that into the water guys and then you want to take one of these blocks all right doesn't have to be the specific one actually place it so it's you know somewhat inside of the harpoon all right and then what you guys want to do is actually take out a pilot seat okay and then of course place it right on top or oh, not like that right on top so that it is sticking straight through the pilot seat you'll know that it actually worked is when you sit down all right it actually tries to move you all right guys so i had a little bit of a problem okay so um you know now it is actually working now that i unanchored the seat so as you can see you know it does that little okay it's just pushing me straight off the seat okay um, when I do sit down it has that little like running animation because this thing is pushing me this way towards the sea guys just for clarification guys you actually don't need a pilot seat a normal car seat would also work just fine so the way to actually make this thing into a, 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 a oh my a conveyor all right is actually pretty simple so what you guys want to do is you actually want to take whatever block you know you want okay and then actually place it inside of the seat um i think you want to uh, anchor off so yeah keep that in mind you basically want to place it inside of the seat okay and then you again can test this bad boy by stepping on it and then it'll actually should do that then what you guys want to do is scale this out all right i'm pretty sure that you don't have to scale it let's see if it's still working here all right yep it is definitely still working all right so um i'm pretty sure you don't have to scale it out i guess we can test it out right here yeah you obviously don't need to scale it out because i just built out and you know that's what it's doing all right it's moving me okay so again guys what you guys could do is you guys could bring uh, uh, okay, that was weird. Um, okay. We're, we're gonna try this again all right we're gonna go out this way and it's not gonna fall so now this thing should be pushing us the whole time yep 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 all right and then what we can do now is we can kind of build this entire a you know an entire platform where we then can actually get pushed around and stuff on this giant platform all right so now this entire thing is now a conveyor and you guys may be wondering like okay how do we get this all right um into there to the actual states and that is when an important part actually comes out and that is with the pistons right here guys 
So what you guys would have to do is build the platform and then actually connect this part to the actual platform itself after it's pushed into there. You just connect it to this conveyor part and then you got it. All right. However, we're actually going to show you guys yet another, even if faster conveyor than this one right here. So this next method is a little bit harder to actually do. So what you guys need to do is actually basically place down whatever item you want, whatever item actually has some real speed to it. Okay. Um, this, I picked a mega thruster. So what we need to do is we want to activate it and then select all and then anchor guys. So instead of having to, um, click here, then going down to click here, I'm simply going to press the number six button and yes. Okay. So we're going to go boom. Okay. See, yeah, I, I wasn't even close guys for the sake of this video. All right. Um, and because you know, I'm a little rusty at it obviously guys we're just going to stick with a normal thruster all right one that is slower just to demonstrate this first off you can do this with the ultra thruster all right which is e extremely fast okay but this is just to demonstrate that you can indeed do it so we activate select all anchor all right hopefully that is still okay perfect perfect so now what we can do is we can simply delete that block and then head over to this other block right here guys so then once we're actually here okay um as you can see this should have some sort yep of you know push to it okay and then what we can do is actually um I'm, I'm i'm not sure if you can attach blocks to it and then it'll still have it you might need the scale tool yeah i believe you still need the scale tool to actually do it that might have actually just ruined it yeah i believe that i've actually ruined this thing yep i did by attaching blocks to it all right, now we're actually going to try this with um, the Ultra Thruster. Um, this is actually my first try on it. Um, I'm not going to record it because I'm probably going to fail a lot at it. So I'll see you all when I actually get it. This is what I mean, guys. I was not even close. Okay, holy crap, guys. All right, it, it took it took you know a couple. Now, nah, nah, that was that was this was my first try. This was my first try, <laughs> but I <laughs> I barely got it. I barely got it. So this thing, holy crap, has a lot of thrust to it. Okay, so we did succeed in actually getting it. Hopefully we. Can oh, okay. Do you still have thrust though? I might have just ruined it. Yeah. Okay. Wait. Wait. So yeah, it does have it does have real thrust to it. Okay. Perfect. 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 So now what we can do is we can actually probably be able to scale this whole thing out. Holy crap! What did what happen? So if we actually went and pushed this thing over inside the stages, then we could actually give this sort of speed to holy crap that I went so far. So we could actually give this um, speed into the people that actually do spawn it, and then they'll shoot out. All right. And then what you guys probably Probably could end up doing is you guys could um, make it so this thing could probably go through all of the stages and make you go super super fast through the stages as sort of some AFK glitch guys all right um, though you know I'm not entirely sure how you know all of the little you know techniques and mechanisms would actually go into that because you know I'm not that good into um, that sort of stuff I'm surprised it's not really pushing me when I'm down below it but the second I get on top holy crap I'm all the way at green green team bro but anyway that is gonna have to conclude this video if you guys all did enjoy make sure you guys all consider hitting that like button subscribing and of course turning on those notifications hope to see you guys on the next video see you guys all later peace out of course goodbye